I'm going to show you how to create a meaningful birthday present on a $10 budget. I bought this cork memo board from Kmart for $8. It's 43 by 43 centimeters and it comes ready to hang. It also comes with eight black push pins, but black wasn't gonna work with my color scheme. So I went and bought these really cute, colorful push pins from Kmart, which cost $2 for 80 of them. Then what I did was I went to my friend's Facebook page and I took some pictures. So there's one of me and her. I got some really cute ones of her on her own and her boyfriend, one of her when she was little, some family photos. She absolutely loves sunflowers and zebras and she took these two photos herself. I've also included some cute little quotes that she likes and a birthday message from me. So I set these up in my design program, Adobe InDesign, but you could use Publisher or Word to get the same effect. And I've designed some of them to look like little Polaroid pictures, which will look really funky when they're all cut out. I then printed them at home on my A3 printer using some thick paper. If you don't have a printer at home, you could take it to your local printer, Officeworks or Kmart. But if getting photos printed isn't an option for you, you can always use things you already have. This might be a letter that your friend has written to you. You could go to Bunnings and get paint swatch cards in their favorite colors. You might have some memorabilia, a menu from their favorite restaurant. Maybe you've been to a show together or overseas. A business card from their favorite place. Old postcards, you can use anything. You don't have to use photos, which is great. For this project, you're going to need an A3 cutting mat, a metal ruler, and a Stanley knife. If you don't want to use a metal ruler and a Stanley knife, you can always just use scissors. So what I'm doing is I'm just cutting along those little crop mark lines there. So when you finish cutting them out, then you just place them on the board where you like them. Have a bit of a play around, see how they fit. So once you're happy with where all the photos are placed, then it's time to pin them on. So I've separated the pink and the white pins from the rest of the colors, because that's the color scheme we're going with. And there you have it, a meaningful birthday present that's not going to break the bank.